Well, new this morning, it is officially tamale season in Texas. During the holiday season, families of Hispanic heritage often celebrate by gathering to make tamales. They're a tradition that have been passed down from generation to generation. Our own Barry Roy shows us how one family is getting wrapped up in the spirit of the season with a family recipe that takes on an extra special meaning this year. <laughs> I don't think that garlic back the same as today. Mom wants to go watch lights, so. Just bring her with you. Tis the season to, to be jolly together. for Terry and for Rachel. And usually we have a, a big aluminum pan. Rolled up. That we put them in. In a Christmas tamale. When she called me, I was like, you know, when she asked me, would you want to make tamales? I'm like, girl, please. I have never done this before. She goes, well, neither have I. So I said, like, okay, well, sure, let's try it. It was good. Bill got him a little one already. But to understand really? this yeah, moment. <laughs> yeah. That one did good. You have to meet someone else. How long has mom been gone now? Almost 13 years. But it's still like yesterday. <laughs> Every year at Christmas, usually the week before, she would make, we would do tamales and chili and all of our coworkers and our friends would come and we'd kind of do a little Christmas thing. She just loved to cook. <laughs> this recipe is special, yes, but it's done yep. something else maybe no one thought of. It's brought all of us clo closer because, I mean, my daughter knew Rachel and them, but and, and her, her son, Brandon, but not like we yeah. hang out now all the time. You can call it a magical Christmas tamale. I bet you do. A family recipe passed it's down to anyone who tastes it. Yeah, I hope we don't have snow it again. And maybe, just maybe, it rolls a family back together this year. It would probably take up the heart thing. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It would be, I don't know, speechless, I guess, knowing that we are, tamales would actually do that for somebody, bring a family back together, that would be great. It has for us, so why not, you know, someone else. In Belton, Barry Roy, 6 News. Pretty cool story there, and it wasn't until I actually moved to Texas that I realized how many families partake in this tamale tradition every year around the holidays. The same. I mean, I, it's a big thing here in Texas. A uh, great family, too, by the way. I mm -hmm. mean, they just, they will spend, uh, they have a last check, and they're taking orders right now, uh, but they are, at last check, they have over 200 dozen orders they need to get out before next week. But they're taking more because it's important to them yeah, to make this happen. Pretty impressive. And uh, you can see their Facebook page right there where you can place your order. But you said that stops today. It does end today. So they would like you to get your orders in today. However many you want, you get it in by today. They'll have them delivered to you next week. So they'll be in touch with you on how they're going to do all that.